happen again. I'm not listening to all that blathering anymore.
I doubt that's ever likely to change. There must be. Hi, where are you off to? We take the Minecrawler secretion from our brothers in the old mine to Kor Kalam. We go to the old mine every day to collect it. What kind of secretion is it? We obtain it from the mandibles of the mine crawlers. If you know how to do it, you can take them out without losing the secretion. Can you tell me how to get the secretion of a mine crawler? Of course. After you've killed the beast, you get hold of the mandibles and pull them straight out. This way, you'll get the secretion gland without destroying it. What does Korkalam need the secretion for? As far as I know, he makes a potion with it which increases the magic powers of a novice. Since we are preparing for the great invocation, he can't get enough of the stuff. With the aid of the potion, he'll prepare the novices for the great day. Have you enough of the potion for the great invocation of the sleeper? No, we still have to collect much more. Our mind crawler hunting units are in action day and night. Tell me anything about the mine? Well, this part we're standing in now is the main shaft. A system of catwalks takes you down to the bottom. And they're digging for ore everywhere. But you need to be careful. There are many mine crawlers there as well. Right at the bottom is the smelting place. We're smelting a part of the ore to use it right there. What do I need to look out for in the mine? Mine crawlers, mainly. Dangerous beasts. We've had to give up a few caves because of them. They've eaten quite a few diggers, too. Tell me about the crawlers. Oh, but my tongue's so dry. You bring me a beer, and I'll tell you something about the crawlers. Here, drink to my health. Thanks. Well, crawlers live in large packs, mostly in the side caves. They've never attacked us here in the main shaft yet. If you ever meet one of them, run. Or stand with your back to the wall. That way you may stand a chance. Tell me more about it. If you want to know more, go to Viper. He's the smelter. Or talk to Ian. He's the boss. He organizes everything here in the mine. Where can I find Ian? He's right in the middle of the main shaft next to the storeroom. Oh, one more thing. You know Thoris, don't you? Forget it. There's just one person who has the say in here, and that's Ian. He's the boss. If you get into trouble with him, you'll be in trouble with us all. Understood? See ya. May I pass through here? What should I keep in mind when I'm in the mine? Beware of the mine crawlers. The further you get down, the closer you get to the beasts. Those rotten creatures come directly from Beliar's realm. You can hear them scraping and scratching. They're sitting in the dark just waiting for you. I've seen them kill. They're merciless and fast. If you enjoy being alive, you shouldn't be down here. You better go before something happens to you.
Can I trade things with you? I have everything you need. What I don't have is no use to you anyway. What do you mean? I only work when the guards are nearby, or they can see me. Otherwise, I just hang around here. Don't they get suspicious? Yeah, well, of course I dig less ore than all the others do. It's not always enough, so I have to do a bit of trading. I keep my ears open, so I get to know many useful things. You don't happen to have some ore on you. Let's say about ten ore. All right, here's ten ore for you. Thanks. If you go to the main shaft and follow the catwalks further down, you'll soon get to two side caves. There's a guard in the second one, and there's also an old masher. There's a healing potion lying about somewhere. But be careful, and beware of the crawlers. And if you need or hear something, come back to me. I'm sure I'll be able to help. Have you got any other useful information? Sure. Have you got ten ore? I expect good information for my ore. There's loads of locked chests here. Glenn, the digger at the top, can get you a couple of lock picks. Good luck. Well, you know where to find me. <laughs> <laughs> 